Today's Secret from the Studio happens uh, on a remote location where the WHTN team, we went out to film interviews with Christian music artists in honor of Gospel Music Week and the Dove Awards. And God really opened so many doors for us to talk to so many really well-known artists this particular year. And they had such great faith stories and such great hope stories. And I was particularly excited about this one interview. Uh, this particular artist at the Dove Awards that year won so many Dove Awards. I mean, God just really worked through his music. I'm not gonna share his name. I'm gonna keep that part up secret because I don't want to embarrass him. What happened behind the scenes was really funny and it teaches us a powerful lesson. And it goes something like this. We go to walk into the room where the interview has been scheduled. He stands up and smiles and I notice immediately that he's got on shorts. He smiles, he shakes my hand, he starts looking around and all of a sudden you kind of see the look on his face and he's like, um, um, is this a television interview? And I said, uh, yeah, Christian Television Network. He goes, oh no, no, no. He said, my publicist told me this was radio. That's why I'm wearing shorts. I didn't think it mattered what I wore. And I said, okay, I'm like, don't worry. We can work through this. We always have a plan B. I said, if you're willing, we'll go ahead. We'll do the interview. We'll just get waist up shots. How does that sound? He goes, that's perfect. And we had a great time talking about his faith, his journey of coming to faith, the kinds of trials that God had seen him through, his songwriting, his singing, and just all of that excitement and hope. And so I share with you today that secret from the studio because it teaches us a great lesson about everyday life. Sometimes things happen that you just can't plan on. And in those times, you always need a plan B. So that's it for today on Secrets from the Studio. Always have a plan B.